this is Game Frost. In today's new video, I mean tutorial video, what we're going to be doing today is we are cryptographically enhanced Pokemon Ultra Sun. So this can actually work for Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon, but I don't know about the uh, about the other two games. Uh, right now we're going to try this on 5x scale because that's literally the max my graphics card can handle, which is a GTX 650, and let's get started. So what we need to do is go and get at least three things that you need to do. First, you need to install Citra Canary. You need to install shaders.zip, uh, which can be found in a Reddit post, but I'm going to give you a direct link. And you can also find um, the Pokemon Ultra Sun textures from a YouTuber uh, named Voltra. I think, yeah, Voltra. Um, thanks to this Reddit post, I actually found out that this shaders thing is actually from, a, from an Android source, an Android Citra source. And I did not know Citra was actually made on Android as well. I mean, Citra's being made on Android, or Android has Citra, whatever. But uh, what you need to do is um, go to App Data, and what you need to do is go on, I think, Roaming, and then click Citra, the Citra folder. And then inside the Citra folder must have a Shaders folder inside, so it can actually work. Now, there's going to be a comparison side-by-side -side with these two videos. Um later on so check that out also um what you need to do is go on the shaders folder that you downloaded and just replace or you just place them in not replace what is wrong with me um and that's about it now on to phase two Alrighty. so the next phase which is phase two is to install um what they call it the textures so what you need to do is go on load on the central folder click textures and then you you see this number or letters with numbers is basically the game's code or ISO number hashtag whatever. And what you need to do is get the down text, the downloaded textures that you got, and just put them all in. Literally every single file you found on that folder, just place them all in. These are basically high res textures. It's HD and it just works. So what you need to do is go on emulation. Con Config, I control, control for uh, God. Uh, and then what you need to do is enable linear filtering. Make sure that's enabled. And then you can pick whether the options, but I prefer FXAA um, natural. F FXAA natural is basically with, um, an option of more vibrant colors and elimination of jagged, jagged edges. What you need to do is enable custom textures and preloaded textures. And keep XBRZ um, Freescale enabled. Now you don't have to enable this, but if you do, if you have a beefy computer, you can. Um, and I actually just placed this up to 150, cause why not? <laughs> um, just to uh, eliminate some lag. And that's about it. Um, think so. Yeah, that's basically it.
thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial video now if 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 it doesn't work out for you or if you're still confused with this tutorial video because it's really quick uh just comment down to me below and i'll actually help you out because literally i hope so many people are in the comments you won't even see how fast i react so yeah if you need help just comment down and i'll actually help you out and yeah so um i hope you guys um would love this graphics enhancement because it's really good i found this out and i'm like wow but um uh, what you need is citra canary you actually need a decent pc for this to work and i mean not decent but like maybe a medium kind of pc like you you could probably get away with like a core i5 or something i don't know because you know in my rig i'm using basically an fx processor with a gtx 650 so yeah um uh, if you guys want to check out my discords um on um, server you can check out in the link in, in the description below and also if you want to check out um other links like let's say donate or whatever it is you can actually check it out if you want to consider subscribing and click the subscribe button click the notification bell icon so you never miss another new video um if we can get at least two likes in this video that'll be greatly appreciated because of course two likes is well enough for me and i just feel happy that somebody actually liked one of my videos um yeah, so if you have any more questions, just comment down below. Or if you have even more, just go to my Discord server and we'll actually talk about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.